What's up guys, it's Mike Devins and welcome to the video 10 gym mistakes that are making you fatter. These are mistakes that I've made myself. Before we jump into the video, as you guys know, every single video in the month of December, I'm either giving away Gymshark, my protein, or my transformation program. In the last video, I just wanted to show you guys that my yank, I think that's how you say it, won some Gymshark, so I might decide in the next video. All you have to do to enter in the next video is to 1. Subscribe to the channel. 2. Click the notification bell button and three, comment anything down below. But in this video, comment any question you want to ask. Six, weights and protein shakes, so be as savage as you can. And then I'll pick the winner from the comments in this particular video. And add your little Instagram handle so I can DM you so you can claim your prize. Throw your diamonds in the sky. The top 10 gym mistakes that are making you fatter. These are my personal experiences and I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys can relate in your early years of training. And maybe if you're new to training, these are mistakes that you might make and hopefully you can avoid them by learning from mine. So number 10 is making overnight gains. Made that music. Hey, tonight I'm really rock. Michael, how are you my brother? The Michael! What's going on, Hey, Papa, focus, focus, focus. Off the computer. Look, look here. Alright, alright, I'm looking, I'm looking. Hey, I have a question for you today. Yeah? Do you see anything different in me today? Uh, do I see anything different? Uh, you wearing a grey vest today, but I don't know. No, idiot! I went to the gym today. Can't you see I made Dave? Stupid, fake ass drink. Hey, 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 bro, you look good, man. You look, you look big. Sorry, dog. Guys, all of us had that point. We kept on looking in the mirror to see if there was any difference, to see if you were able to put some muscle on those bones. But my honest truth is, guys, take time, be patient. Some people take 10 years or even more, or some people take less to develop their dream physique. But my biggest advice is be patient and enjoy the process. And at number nine is buying all kinds of supplements. Made that music. When I started training, I bought every supplement that was out there that would help me with fat loss. And over time, the more knowledgeable I became, I realized that I wasted so much money. So do your research before buying any kinds of supplements and also buy the ones that are most cost effective. Personally, that was a mistake that I made. I'm sure you guys had all kinds of supplements expecting overnight gains. But for you guys, if you're new, <laughs> hey yo, Jamaica, what are you training today, bro? Obviously, Monday is International Chess Day. Uh, stupid question. Uh, Alright, and tomorrow? Ah, ah, Tuesday is Girls for the Girls. Bicep every day. Okay, 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 chill, chill, chill. What about the next day? Ah, you are disturbing my costume. On a Wednesday, you revert back to International Chess Day. It's simple. Ah, ah you are disturbing me. <laughs> Alright, dog. <laughs> Chill. Now, 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 we all know that at some point in our career, we were doing the bro split. Chest, arms, chest, arms, legs. But my best advice is if you're a beginner, do an upper body, lower body split. And if you're maybe in towards your intermediate to advanced, maybe a push pull legs like I love doing. And then onwards, you can try and experiment with different things. Everybody's body is different. But search for a good training split to build a holistic physique. Train your legs because it will affect the rest of your upper body and so on. And at number seven is overdoing cardio. Made that music. Guys, you cannot lie to me. If you're one of the guys who wanted to lose fat, you're spending an hour on the treadmill, two hours, who knows? But in reality, someone, I watched a video somewhere that said, if you spend 20 minutes on the treadmill burning 200 calories, all you really need to do is eat 200 calories less 
Yes, cardio has its place. I love doing cardio when I'm cutting down, but just be knowledgeable of how much cardio you're doing and if you really need to. And at number six, my personal favorite that I know a lot of you guys have done at some point is skipping leg day. Layback music. Go give it to you. What? Wait for you to get it on your own. X go deliver to you. Knock knock. So guys, skipping leg day, it will develop your physique holistically. When I started training legs, I saw my whole upper body change. There are many hormone receptors in your body that can be activated from training legs, which can help the entire physique at the end of the day. Moving on into number five is training with ego. Layback music. Now, I was one of those guys who would rack up the bench press, go halfway and go all the way back and I ended up developing a square chest. I know it sounds weird, but I ended up doing it. Train with proper form and don't train with ego. It's fine to do a bit of cheat curls every now and then. Let's move on to number four and that is training with proper form. Form can go a long way. One, you will prevent any injuries and two, you'll activate most of your muscles so also at the same time, you'll be putting in the work that's needed for you to be able to develop a holistic chest or fully develop your biceps. Sometimes when you do half reps or when you're not training properly, your body won't look the way you need it to. So use proper form. And at number three is learning nutrition 101. Playback music. Damaikas, I thought you were on a diet. Pringles, lettuce, Pringles, health. And a lot of us, I know a lot of us thought that a lot of the things we ate was healthy, but it was actually not helpful at all in terms of calories in versus calories out. That is the number one rule. You need to be in a caloric deficit to lose weight and to be in a caloric surplus to gain weight. Once you know that rule, the rest is really explained. Number two. This was personally for me because when I started training, I wanted to like get more girls. That was my main motivation and eventually it changed. I do it for myself. Don't go to the gym because you know, you want to impress someone. Don't do it with a feel that it's not from within. So train for yourself and eventually you'll see that you'll be so much happier in the long term. I know a lot of us started for different reasons, but at the end of the day, those of us who've been training over a year, train for ourselves. the end the best one is enjoy the process enjoy the journey as you guys have seen I've documented my three years on this channel in terms of how my body has developed and I've loved every single day of it of getting to a high body fat and lowering it down and getting to single digit body fats I've learned so much about my body and at the same time about my mind I've learned about dedication persistence you know hard work those things that I learned in the gym, I translate into medical school in every aspect of my life. There's a lot of things that gym can help you out with. And if you haven't done it before, if you've never trained, try it out. But guys, that is the end of the video. Let's pick our winner for the previous video, as you guys can see. So I am going to copy the link of this video here. I'm going to paste it in the YouTube Ramen comment picker. Search it there. Let's see how many comments we got. Let's see, let's see, let's see. We got around, what, 400? We're going, 581 comments in the last video. So guys, your chances are high if I'm gonna upload more 
And if you guys drop the likes, shit, you might just win something. So the winner is, let's see. Doom, doom, doom. The winner is Mohammed Almawit. He says, here in Sweden, it's shit weather every day. <laughs> Alright, bro, Moscow is the same. So M, I'm gonna DM you, bro, and I will DM you about your prize, but let's get on to the video. Hope you enjoyed it. I hope that it was entertaining and informative. So the next video is gonna be a Q&A, six weights and protein shakes. You guys know the drill. Comment your most savage questions down below that are with regards to sex, weights, or protein shakes. It can be anything. Comment down below, leave your Instagram handle, leave the video a like, subscribe, click the bell button, and I will pick the next winner of the prize. I am going to send your package right now, bro. I'll see you guys in the next one. This is the previous video, which is dope, and that is the subscribe button if you're not subscribed, and I'll see you guys in the next one.